Hello, everybody, and uh, this is Michael. In this video, we will talking about uh, um, one wild digital temperature sensor DS18B20 timing and coding. Okay. Um, for the timing and coding um, for this chip, we only folk we only need folks three of it. One is reset and start. Another one is read, read one and read, read z one, read zero and read one, and write, write zero and write one. Okay. So we can um, we can open the data sheet of the chip, and uh, in the at the page fifteen. So you can find the timing. Okay. So it will uh, detail describe about the reset and the start and the read and write and write time slot here. So this is uh, initialized timing. Okay. And uh, um. This is uh, this is read and write timing, timing slow, but from the data sheet timing, uh, you you maybe will see the timing like this fifteen to sixty, and uh, sixty to two hundred forty. This kind of value. Mm -mm. Maybe you you don't know how to decide, choose what kind of value will be the best for the for the communication. Okay, at this time, I will suggest you take a look at this. Okay, so this. This application note one while communication through the software, and this document is not only for this chip. For all of the one while communication, it will be uh, uh, it will fit for all of the one while communication chip. Okay, uh, let's take a look at the document. If you Google it, you will get the document like this. Okay, so it tell you to uh, easily generate the one wire timing signal. Okay, and uh, this is the int uh, introduction. Uh, the most interesting I want to show you is here. So you will see this this figure is different from the previous one. You will see here. This is right, and it give you a, a letter A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, and this is very interesting things. So um, you will see. You will you will read. Uh, if you read the whole whole description here, and then read this. It tell you delay G timing and then drive the bus low, and the delay H timing and the release the bus delay I timing, and the zombo bus zero equal devices present and one equals no devices present and then delay J. From this table. The implementation and the description and the operation tell you every detail about how you can control the one wire bus. You will see exactly tell you drive the bus lower and then delay A timing, release bus, delay B timing. And uh, what what about the A B C D and this kind of Value how we decide it, and then you can go go through down here. Uh, this table 
tell you exactly at the standard standard speed uh, how much you should uh, you should give the value to A and overdrive speed how much you should give it to A and there is just a two uh, two situation you even can calculate these values and if you download this it will give you a file which can calculate all of these uh, numbers so if you want to control the one wire bus chip follow the follow the uh, description here follow it exactly and you will easily control the um, the 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 one one wire bus chip and uh, so actually is if you write in the FPGA and uh, according to this flow you can you can easily write the the, the code and uh, and uh, and show the waveform and to see the waveform is match the figure here or not okay this is the first thing you you find this document is bad is much better than the um, than the data sheet here than the data sheet description okay the second thing so you will see the document give you the SQL SQL examples uh, is here SQL, SQL examples basic function and we'll uh, tell you how to present the uh, um, flow to control flow to implement a uh, flow in C language format okay in C language format so uh, this is the uh, second thing the third thing is the last thing maybe uh, for our for our uh, FPGA Verilog call is very important and it's very useful is at here okay you will go you will look at here maybe so uh, maxim provide a predefined one while must in Verilog and VHDL this is an IP we can open it in a new tape this is a IP call this is free and you can request it from the uh, maximum company okay so um, is, uh, it uh, detail introduce the, uh, um, the IP in the document okay so this is FPGA and the communication by the one one IO bus and this pin is control the um, voltage so uh, you can you can uh, link multiple uh, one wire bus devices in the same bus okay and this is description and this is the interface for the um, this is the interface for the IP call for the IP call this is date uh, this is uh, in and out data bus and this is control logical you make it write or read this is enable okay so uh, this is clock so for the for the if you have this uh, this is a detailed description of all the signal of all the signal okay so you can get the dis uh, detailed information here if you have the um, IP call so and you can easily control the one wire bus chip and also it is um, it is free okay it is free you can um, request by here this is the free IP is available by request okay it's here okay so that's for the timing and the coding for the uh, temperature sensor this one 
and uh, uh, from different documents you can find the more detail and the more useful information for the timing and also you can find the C example and uh, um, Verilog uh, IP for the code for the for the FPGA coding okay that's it and um, this is Michael and uh, I hope you will like it and support us